Next, we'll crochet the tail. Work into a magic ring. Wrap the yarn around your fingers like this. Make a loop around your mid-finger and pinch the crossover of the yarn. Insert hook into the loop on mid-finger. Hook the yarn and pull up loop. A magic ring is formed on mid-finger. In round 1, start with 1 chain stitch. Then work 6 crochets. Finally, end with 1 snip stitch. Work 1 chain stitch first. Then work 6 crochets. Mark the first single crochet. Continue to work 5 more single crochets in the same way. Six and crochets are done. Pull the yarn tail tight to close the ring. Remove the marker. And work one snip stitch in the first stitch. Okay. Round 1 is done. Pull the yarn tail tied. In round 2, start with 1 chain stitch. Then work set of 1 single crochet 1 increase for 3 times. Finally, end with 1 snip stitch. Work 1 chain stitch first. Then work 1 single crochet and 1 increase as 1 set. Work 1 single crochet first. Mark the first dozen crochet. Then work one increase, which means working two single crochets in the same stitch. One set is done. The second set. One single crochet. Next one increase. The second set is done. The third set. One single crochet. Next, one increase. Three sets are done. Remove the marker. And work one snip stitch in the first stitch. Round 2 is done. In round 3, start with 1 chain stitch. Then work 9 single crochets. Finally, end with 1 slip stitch. Work 1 chain stitch first. Then work 9 single crochets. Mark the first single crochet. Continue to work 8 more single crochets.
Nine some crochets down. Remove the marker. And work one slip stitch in the first stitch. Round three is done. Break yarn, leaving a long yarn tail for sewing. Remove the hook. The tail is completed.